Okay, Venus removal. Before you start removing your Venus, starting with these nuts, you have to remove these two caps. You need the Allen key. I spray some uh, penetration fluid before, so you need the Allen key and probably a hammer. I'm gonna try to do it by hand. Hold on. No. Okay. So now be ready because there is gonna be some spillage. So prepare yourself. No, the oil has drained before, so no problem. Oh. In this video I'm just going to show you how to remove Venus. I'm not going to show you how to change seals or do the rattling fix. So now, small pliers to remove small cups inside. One and two. And now, very important stuff. You need a Torx T30, I think. T30, and now there are two small screws inside and they, are, they have a left thread so to undo them you need to rotate your ratchet clockwise like this So now, socket size 10, Now here, this one, it's size 11. Just holding the lifting bracket. And over that is number size uh, 13 but to remove that I need to loose up this banjo bolt
Everything is a little bit corroded. So this is your cylinder head without Venus unit. If you if you changing seals and removing Venus, you don't need to to align the timing like I said before. But if you start messing around with crankshaft, you could see that spline already has moved and there might be a chance of of them to, to pop out however it's very unlucky un unlikely so when you're doing your seals and uh, removing venus don't touch the other side leave it and it should be fine your timing timing should be fine if you want to do bigger job you have to remove all the camshafts so you have to start with these two chains secondary and primary one two three four five six one two three nine nuts few sprockets few wheels spacers tensioner and then you can start with removing uh, camshafts so that's it for now thank you for watching